Changing a flat is dirty, hard work and quite frankly, can be dangerous. That's why Kia offers the Tire Mobility Kit in certain models. A quick and easy way to get you back on the road and to your Kia dealership to repair or replace the tire. The Tire Mobility Kit, or TMK for short, replaces the spare tire, jack and lug wrench. In the unfortunate instance that a tire becomes flat, first things first, pull over to a safe place, stop the car, select park, and turn on the hazard flashers. Remember, the tire mobility kit will work for punctures in the tire's tread of about a quarter inch or six millimeters. Any larger than that, or if the damage is to the sidewall, then this kit probably won't do the trick and you'll have to call roadside assistance. Now go to the trunk. Beneath the floor is the tire mobility kit. This kit contains a sealant canister, which is good for one use, and a compressor, which is used to inflate the tire. At the back of the compressor is the inflation hose and the power cord, which plugs into the 12 volt outlet. If you can see the nail or screw that has caused the puncture, do not remove it. First, twist the cap off the stem of the deflated tire. The first connection is the inflator hose to the canister and the hose from the canister to the stem. On kits where the pressure gauge is attached to the inflator hose, make sure the screw cap is tightened. This is used to reduce tire pressure and needs to be closed at this point. Insert the canister on the compressor. At this point, you want to make sure the compressor is switched to off. Take the extension cord and plug it into the power outlet of the vehicle. Switch on the compressor and let it run for approximately five to seven minutes until the tire pressure reaches the required setting as stated in your owner's manual. What's happening now is the canister is emptying the sealant into the tire and the compressor is filling the tire with enough air so you can drive it. If, after seven minutes, the tire pressure does not reach the required PSI, the hole in the tire is too large to repair with the tire mobility kit. In this case, call Kia Roadside Assistance and have the vehicle towed to the nearest Kia dealer. If the tire reaches the desired PSI, disconnect the canister from the valve stem and the compressor, unplug the outlet, and put everything back into the tire mobility kit's bag and in the trunk. Remove this sticker from the sealant canister and place it somewhere you can see it within the vehicle, like on the steering wheel or dash, to remind you to drive at the safe speed limit listed on it until you have the tire repaired or replaced. Now drive the car for about 10 minutes at a speed that does not exceed 80 km per hour. This action spreads the sealant around the inside of the tire and seals the leak. Having driven for 10 minutes, pull over, Retrieve the compressor and check the tire's pressure. If it needs more air, inflate it to the correct pressure. If it is overinflated, depress the yellow button and drop the pressure to the correct setting. After ensuring the tire is properly sealed, you can drive cautiously on the tire up to 200 kilometers, remembering not to exceed 80 kilometers per hour. It is recommended to visit the nearest Kia dealer to have the tire repaired or replaced as soon as possible. Don't forget to replace the sealant canister as well. Systems may vary from vehicle to vehicle. Please refer to the owner's manual or consult your local Kia dealer for more information on this feature.